And we're back to the um, set of Norn Tales. Um, this, as you can see, Kane is wandering around. Uh, <sighs> Let's see. Can I convince them to have another kid? Um, twinning in this game is rare, but it does occur. Um, mainly from by, r from what I understand, there's a random chance of it occurring. Um, as you can see, she is expecting twins. So, this is kind of exciting. <sighs> And oh, incidentally, homesickness is one drive that is not detected by this thing, but that Norns actually do feel. Well, only female Norns feel it, and it makes them want to go he here to lay their eggs. Although, it doesn't always work mainly because they're not always smart enough to figure out where they need to go. But, anyway. So... Wins. So, I don't know what to name her. Mm, just something random, I guess. sister. Um, something random as well. Oh, and incidentally, Norns can have both identical and fraternal twins. And from what I can tell, the way to figure out whether you got identical or fraternal twins is whether they both have crossover points and point mutations. Because um, if they're identical, one will be a clone of the other, according to the game. These two are fraternal twin girls. Incident another thing is because the gender is not genetic in Norns, identical twins can be opposite gender, which does not happen in humans. Come on, little one. Hey. Hey. Foobab. Okay. Push the button.
there. And, uh, okay, good. Alright, so now they're both educated. You know what? I think I will hatch a couple of guys for them. Um, this and a fallow norn. Incidentally, the one in this egg, um, he's a Siamese, a CFE Siamese norn. And um, Oh, I think the population limit has been reached. Yeah. Fallow Norns are another breed that just looks different, but is basically the same underneath, but the CFE Siamese are different. Siamese Norns just look different, but CFE it stands for Creature Full of Edit. Uh, creatures Full of Edits. And they are... They are basically intended to be smarter than regular Norns. And the really neat thing is that they were not um, they were not made by the makers of this game. They're a third party breed, the C CFE e Norns. Um, they actually come in several breeds, um, depending on what you prefer. I happen to prefer Siamese, so that's what I've got here, but they come in several breeds. Um, and um, one thing, and I, I think they're a good example of one of the things that's really cool about this game, which is the modding community here. Um, like, there are people who have um, who have made um, new breeds of Norns that you can get and there are utilities for genetically engineering the Norns and there are also people who have made new injectable agents. Like if I go here, the high bounce rubber balls were made by the makers of the game but the Eggernator was not. The Eggernator can do a number of useful things like if I were to stick her here I could decide to clone her or I could put an egg in her or if she was pregnant I could take an egg out um, and I can also use this button to create an egg from a genome whether or not there's an orn in there um, but I'm not going to do that right away. Um, anyway. Now, with CFE Norns, I haven't really noticed that many differences. Um, because with them, the differences in their behavior are somewhat s subtle. But we'll see if we notice anything unique about Tom here compared to the others. And now I will say goodbye.